Engineer 775 here wanted to talk to you about uh, a way to preserve your eggs. Uh, as most of you that raise chickens already know, you get a ton of eggs in the spring, throughout the summer, and then th during the winter time when the light starts going down, uh, less light per day means your egg production goes that way down. So there's a lot of different ways to preserve eggs, refrigeration, um, there's, you know, you've seen people even on the doomsday preppers putting mineral oil on, on eggs. Um, I don't know if you've heard of this though, this is sodium silicate. This is a method that my grandmother used to preserve eggs and, and it's been around for a long time. Sodium silicate has many uses, but one of them is to preserve eggs. How, what am I talking about? When you read the label on this thing, it talks about uh, sealing your concrete floors. And so you wouldn't think that you would want to mix this with your food. <laughs> but it's a great method. And the cool thing about this, this is probably the longest um, method, the longest time in preserving your eggs is to use sodium silicate besides refrigeration. So what am I talking about? What kind of time? Nine months um, worth of time. And that's great because that can get you through a, you know, through the winter and you'd have plenty of eggs all the time. So when you have all those eggs coming in in dozens and dozens and you don't know what to do with them, preserve them. And this one jar will preserve around 200 dozen of your farm eggs. So that's great. And this stuff stores, this has an expiration date of 2016, 2017. And so this will last a long time. This is from a company called Humco, H-U-M-C-O. And it's called sil Sodium Silicate Solution, otherwise known as water glass. And just for the video, I've got a small crock, some eggs, and the, the ratio is nine, nine parts water to one part of sodium silicate. And so I'm just going to mix these two together. So for this, I'm putting three ounces of sodium silicate in here, and I'm going to mix it with the nine parts water. And sodium silicate is highly soluble in water and so this mixes up really really easy so I'm gonna put this off to the side if we can still see that i'm going to take eggs and you want the eggs that you want to get are right from your chicken you don't want to clean the eggs other than take the big stuff off but the uh, the bloom the natural coating that the chicken that the hen puts on the eggs you want to leave that alone because that's that seals the egg too so you just add your eggs to your crock Fill the crock up, and this is just a, a small crock. Obviously, you can get other containers. You can do five-gallon pails if you want. Um, I'm just used to. I like crocks. Uh, but I used to see in my grandparents' basement with sauerkraut and eggs and all different sorts of things. I didn't know what they were at the time um, that they used to store. So again, be able to get nine months is a great thing. So you just add your sodium silicate, and you want to have about an inch above your eggs. Yep, yeah, an inch above your eggs. And then that is pretty much it. Store it in your basement, store it in a cool, dry place, and you've got those eggs are good for nine months. How do I know that they're good? There's a simple test. Uh, once you um, you don't have any eggs in January, February, and you want to use this, begin using these eggs, then you pull them out and you can put them in water. And if they sink, they're good. If they float, they're not. Dead things rise to the top. So it's a pretty uh, simple test. But it's the uh, kind of the coolest way I found to store eggs, and it's using sodium silicate solution. And um, that's pretty much it. So you can get this at a local um, drug, drug store, local pharmacy in your town, sodium silicate. Uh, Engineer 775, thanks for watching.